All the times we nearly lost each other. Not sure I can remember them all. I remember. All we have ever needed is each other. We have survived crisis after crisis. We have overcome everything that life has thrown at us. What makes you think that we can't get out of this well? This is nothing. This is a walk in the park. Please. I need you to come back to me. Luke needs you. I need you. Our baby needs you, please. Say it again. And again. I guess we're pretty lucky, huh? We are blessed. This last time with Evan. All we had to do was let his hand slip. And I could have lost you forever. I will not let you do this. <laughs> Okay, buddy, it's all right. He's almost ready. I think you have to carry that second number. No, that's wrong. I'm not eating this. It's disgusting. You know what, you girls, you need to cut me some slack here, okay? I, I'm not used to cooking dinner and checking homework. Your mother, she was so much better at this. What? What is it? Don't make me eat anymore. Our teachers need to practice these problems with our parents. You know what? I just need to feed your brother first, okay? You never have any time for me anymore. Hey, buddy. I'm doing my best here. This parenting thing, it's a two-person job. I just don't know if I can do it alone. There you go. You're not alone. You know the best part about heaven? I can see the future. And I have seen it. I've seen all the cute boys that you're going to date. And one very, very special young man who is going to adore you as much as I do. He's going to love everything about you. Everything. Even the things that you think are unlovable. He's very young. But he is looking for you. And he wants to find you. And you have to make it easy for him to find you. So that when he is ready to be with you, you're ready to. You're going to be just as happy as I was with your father. Calm down. Get sleepy all of a sudden, but thanks. Your old man needed that. Hey, Dad, you're right about carrying that second number. It worked. Excellent. You get a gold star. So, can we make brownies now? I thought you weren't hungry. I ate an apple. The brownies are for the bake sale tomorrow. Didn't you get the note from Natalie's teacher? You know what? I, I don't think we have all the ingredients to make brownies. And you know what? Look at this kitchen. But I have to bring something to the bake sale. All right, all right, all right. Fine. We'll... We'll make brownies, somehow. Just need to clean up this mess first. Can't believe how easy that was. Lily. You did this. Natalie's homework. Makes appetite. Ethan going to sleep. Even the brownies. How did you? You made a vow. Remember? For better or worse. Till death do us part. How 
bodies can be parted. Not souls. Not soulmates. Who are you talking to? Your mother. I was just, uh... I was apologizing for making such a mess of this kitchen. Looks okay now. Yeah, you're right. It does, doesn't it? Good job. Mom would have been proud of you. Bodies can be separated. Souls, not soulmates. Admit it. You've been helping me. I kind of bent the rules a little. We're only supposed to observe. Meddling is a no-no, but I. I couldn't take watching you suffer. I don't want you helping from... from wherever. I want you here. With me. I'm sorry, Hilda. I miss you. So much. I know. Even you weren't perfect, I wasn't perfect, but together we were. So... Thank you.